Karma is the spice of life, and he got what he deserved. Long story short, in 2020, my ex-husband cheated on me with my ex-best friend, whom I thought was a sister, and left me for a good two weeks before my birthday. She moved in with us for a while because she had nowhere else to go. I helped move her in, babysat her three-year-old kid, got her special diet food, helped find schools, helped find a new place to live, etc. I did everything. Only to find out they were effing on the sofa while I slept upstairs the entire time. My ex was very abusive, rape, verbal abuse, etc. wasn't a hitter though. He made me become agoraphobic. I couldn't even be home alone without him. My ex was very abusive. He wasn't a hitter though. He made me become agoraphobic. I couldn't even be home alone without him. We had been trying for a baby for months. He got her pregnant immediately. At the time, rose tinted glasses made me think, everything is okay. Anyway, cut to yesterday. I'd just finished work, and walking back from town I bumped into him. This is the first time since 2020 he spoke to me. You were right you know, he said. I looked at him. She cheated on me, then dumped me last week. I simply snorted, not wanting to burst out laughing. I don't even think the baby's mine, he added sadly. I simply shook my head with a grin on my face, said take care of yourself, then walked away. What's even better is that he is stuck living with her because his mum won't have him back, and the landlady doesn't want to help him after all the abuse he put me through. Side notes relating to the story if you're interested. Her ex-husband not only accused her of cheating, but thought she had a thing for my ex-husband, something I didn't believe until she did that to me. She had said to me once that she hadn't had ex in three years, then on a different day claimed she couldn't go without one day let alone a week. Alarms rose, but I knew she wouldn't do that to me. After all the help I'd given her, she completely refused to help me full stop. I lost my home because of her and had to move back in with my parents. She completely abandoned me. I know she will never be happy in life, and I'm honestly loving that fact. I hope the baby is his, so he is stuck knowing her for the rest of his life. No two people deserve misery more.